pollution was actually getting uh, way too much to handle well uh, uh, my uh, my mother is uh, uh, borderline asthma pa- patient so am i um, uh, borderline asthma pa- patient so yeah there are few um, candidates for us uh, you know in our family for whom we need the air purifier um with the, the deteriorating quality of air that uh, we have in our city um i think we we would, we would need a, an industrial level air purifier the concern of these residents in the national capital region is backed by data from the central pollution control board the cpc we found that the number of days when the air quality index regularly touched severe levels in november 2021 was the highest ever recorded the forecast for the coming days is not great either but just as the air outside is hazardous indoor pollution often doesn't get the attention it deserves indoor air pollution is also a very important aspect which is largely you know ignored the outdoor quality and in fact could be worse two to five times worse which is very commonly seen and it could be even 100 times worse it is uh, it, it produces inflammation in the body it reduces the immune system more chances of infection more chance of cancer development more not only lungs but all over i mean the kidney pancreas uh, uh, stomach cancer all those are more common even covid infection has been found to be more in people who have been exposed to polluted areas like urban cities covid infection is less in the rural areas but in urban areas all over the world you find that you know the covid infection was more and more severe so it really affects our immunity many diseases i mean respiratory wise you have got chest infection pneumonia asthma copd lung cancer or risk of cardiac events uh, heart attacks irregular uh, heart beats arrhythmias more chance of stroke uh, memory impairment then uh, loss of uh, libido uh, preterm deliveries so number of risks are there and cancer of uh, intestine pancreas kidney stomach they are all high so it can has a manifold effect actually i think the kitchen has to be well ventilated it should have a chimney if possible number 2 if somebody is smoking in the house somebody who is a smoker should quit smoking because it not only affects the smoker but there is a high risk of passive smoking among the children with its some you know harmful effects so quit smoking third thing is if uh, uh, we must avoid using any can uh, incense uh, like agarbatti dhoopatti during puja uh, so that is also important fourthly if there is a dampness somewhere in the house like uh, some uh, old furniture or you know dampness fungus over the wall that should be cleaned properly use more of a vacuum rather than you know dusty because then you know the particles are spread you know it remains suspended in the air for a long period of time and there are you know plants which are available um uh, indoor plants which can help in you know controlling their pollution and uh, give a pure air so that is one thing and uh, sometime of the, of the day if you know you can have uh, the sunlight in your house uh, that would also help so there are some simple measures if the air quality we should monitor the air quality if the air quality is very poor outside but then somebody who is uh, you know has got an like respiratory disease or cardiac disease he should avoid venturing outside and avoid any strenuous exercises like you know running jogging uh, during this point of time so take care of the check the air quality and if uh, when the air quality is good if your levels are with acceptable then only go out and do big exercises you can do indoor yoga uh, that is that helps breathing exercises uh, so those things can help i think physical activity physical exercise is very important one should not compromise on that but yes one has to look at the air quality where you are doing these exercises a healthy person who is doesn't have any respiratory diseases in the past and who doesn't have a cardiac disease he can go out and go for a walk with you know my using mask and do some uh, you know physical exercises uh, within a limited period of time but avoid any strenuous exercise because you know then 
the volume of the pollutant air and uh, pollutant material is significantly higher when you do jogging and do vigorous exercise because then you breathe very hard so simple walking can be done with the uh, you know mask somebody who is got a underlying respiratory disorder is better to use a 95 mask okay but otherwise uh, for uh, general public who do not have any underlying respiratory diseases they can use ordinary triple layer mask because filtration micro particles of you know less than 2 mic 2 or 3 micron can be filtered only with an n95 mask so uh, those who are vulnerable n95 mask otherwise simple mask the balanced diet is important okay uh, and neither over eat nor under eat keep your body properly nourished uh, proper hydration that helps uh, Uh, age old things like uh, maybe tulsi uh, green teas they can help uh, nobody knows but possibly they can help and uh, yeah i mean it has to be a mix of everything right you must have a adequate mix of protein fat uh, sugars nutrients vitamins uh, nuts so that helps it is not a particular one single food that is going to help you it's a basically a balanced diet that helps but yes things like uh, kahwa um maybe hot drinks they would be preferable rather than the you no know, cold drinks uh, cold beverages right something coming out of the food so i think temperature control is more important avoid anything which is cold which has lot of smells like very rich food and which is smelling like talka lagne se mai jo chhok chhok lagta hai so those kinds of things have to be avoided otherwise a balanced diet normal balanced diet will do